All right, well, my name is Sean Johnson. I'm from Mount Shasta, California, and I'm very grateful to be driving in the WRC2 this season with Santalak Racing in a Citroen C3 Rally 2. This is now the beginning of our third season with Santalak, is that in 2019, we did a split program of doing the Junior WRC and the ERC. And then when it came time to make the jump up into the, the R5 car, you know, the C3 had already shown itself to be a very, very competitive car um, of this classification. So yeah, there was every reason to continue with Santalak. And, and uh, for, for the 2021 season, um, we just with the same logic, keeping the, the same program, the same relationship, we've developed and worked a lot together in the last years and so we're, uh, we're just taking the next step together. So I actually come from a, a very odd background is that I'm one of the people who came through the original Nissan GT Academy where they put the fastest video game racers in real cars is that yeah I, I'm one of the people that comes from a pure sim background it was clear for me that uh, I wanted to try the sport of rallying because for me just motorsport out in nature um, you know, with fans uh, just right there experiencing the action is that for me, it's a much more int intimate form of motorsport. So um, yeah, I decided to go rallying and yeah, here we are in my fourth season rallying and I'm absolutely loving it. Definitely feel like I've, I've found my home in motorsport. And my brother took me to my first champ car race in person when I was seven and Alex had already won the race and did donuts right in front of us. And that was the moment in my life that I really knew that motorsports is my passion. This is, this is what I'm doing with my life. It was 2015, um, I actually decided to go spectate the German round of the World Valley Championship and standing stage side and watching these cars go by and, you know, listening and within a you know 10 meter radius hearing seven different lang languages being spoken, you know, like I said earlier, is that rally for me is this combination of motorsport, nature and humanity. Um, it's, I just absolutely love it. So that, that one weekend spectating Rally Germany in 2015 really catalyzed for me this, this new passion for rallying. Having the pre-existing relationship with Santelac, a very experienced French team with a good relationship to the, the, the Citroen factory was, was for sure, um, uh, a big plus. But yeah, looking back to last year is that, you know, we drove Monty in the, in the 208 R2, um, had our first rally victory. You know, Alex and I won the class and two wheel drive overall. Um, but then looking at the results of that event in the, in the rally two, is that I believe it was the top five positions were all the Citroen C3. So, you know, it was pretty clear to see that uh, in the overall standings in the championship from the previous season and the, uh, the results from Monte Carlo, is that the the Citroen C3 Rally 2 was very very competitive? You know we know that uh, we're well supported and that we have a, a good program uh, and good equipment when when we run with this with this package. So that's that's how it all came together. Oh, so hard to pick out a favorite moment. I particularly enjoy the countdown, the the three, two, one when I when I go to full throttle and the you know the cars in launch mode and just that that building up of energy and preparation and focus to this one moment when we then get to head off into the stage is, is always something quite special. But I also really love that there are many, many times uh, during the recce and during the rally as well when we're driving through these just gorgeous natural landscapes and when I get to pinch myself that, hey, I'm, I'm here in this incredible piece of racing equipment, uh, taking in this gorgeous sunrise or this gorgeous sunset um, from this seat is that it's, it's truly an honor and such a gift to, to get to see the world through the context of, of such an amazing sport. There's just something really, really beautiful and poetic about driving one of these cars on gravel is that it's so much fun and it's, uh, I don't know, for me, it's, it's, it's more artistic. Um, yeah, how you work with the car on, on the loose surface. I, I quite, quite enjoy it. So um, something like a Rally Finland or a Rally Estonia where you have very fast roads uh, with big commitment and you know, blind corners and crests and jumps. For me, that is, uh, it's just, it's breathtaking. I love it. So yeah, we, we have the, the budget for at least six European rounds of WRC2 and we're actively working hard to, to raise the money for the seventh then flyaway round. 